Hello, and welcome back to the underground. Fuck me. So, I decided I am going to make a video where I try and get that television down to the, um, the gunsmith to see what kind of bonus character there is, and I would make a video of me doing it, because I haven't made a video of a delve with the hunter yet, and I almost, almost forgot to grab the TV. I was halfway through the second floor, but when I remembered, oh wait, I need to go pick up that television. And then, while, after I had cleared the entire floor, I beat the boss, and then I did my customary celebratory dodge roll into the elevator, and I forgot that dodge rolling drops the television, and Nope. Can't dodge roll. Not with the TV. The television just dropped right out of my pocket as I dove into the elevator. I, I amaze even myself with my stupidity sometimes. I really do. I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not gonna upload that video. I'm just gonna see if I can remember talking about everything that I wanted to talk about that I did talk about that those I don't think those words made any sense in that order. Ooh, the gamma rank. That's kinda half decent. It's, it's, it really isn't, but it's half decent. Okay, so, um, man, that is, it's, it's just disheartening. Like, I could accept getting killed by my own stupidity, but accidentally dropping the item that is the entire reason that I wanted to do this run, oh my lord, I just feel, I feel like garbage, like just a piece of garbage. If I knew how to edit, I would probably, like, just have that clip. But I've reached my- NO FUCK ME, damn it! Like, just that one clip of me losing all hope in myself and faith in myself. As I dove into the elevator. Ugh. I still don't have any editing software yet, because I am le poor, and I need the monies for food and gas. Note to sell. See if there's any, um, free editing software on the internet that I could use, maybe. <sighs> so much ammunition. Okay, so, um, right. Things to talk about. The crossbow and reloading mechanics. I'll get to that pretty soon. I've got keys, got the shopkeeper. Oh yeah, the Huntress! As you can see, I'm wearing the Huntress's alternate outfit, because that wolfskin cape is just awesome, and I like it. And there is, um, there, there were bleh, multiple reasons that I wanted to choose the Huntress, one of which is that, uh, since I'm trying to take the TV down to the gunsmith, the TV takes up an active item slot, so... Right off the bat, if I was going to try and do the Convict or the Marine, I would lose their active item, which that would be just a waste. And I could do the Pilot, but... Eh! I wanted that sexy wolf cape. And what's this? Potion of Lead Skin. Become Invincible. Well, I'm not going to be able to use that after I get the TV. Temporary Invulnerability. Fun. Remind me to use that against the boss. But, yeah, there was that, there was that, and then also, I wanted to do the Huntress because I feel like there's still some unanswered questions in the Huntress's past. Like, I, I tried to examine one of those dead soldiers, and then the wolf started yapping, and then she cut off the examination to bark at the wolf. So we didn't see that, but... More importantly, I want to try and kill the boss without killing the scientist, because I feel like that's an important thing. The Trigger Twins, yes, okay. I'm just gonna keep them both poisoned with this thing.
Wait, did my dog just eat a bullet just there? I am not horribly fond of this gamma ray. It's not the strongest of weapons. I really would have liked something a little bit tougher to go against this ball. Okay, he's down. He's down. Ugh, okay. We're good. Didn't even use that, uh, potion of lead skin. Go ahead and refill the gamma ray, because why the F not? Proton backpack and the master round. Got the master round. That's what matters. Okay. Which I actually don't think I got the master round on my previous horrendous attempt. I could go back and buy the, um, buy the other key from the dude. That shopkeeper, bleh, not gonna. I'm just gonna go. Six minutes and twenty seconds for the first floor. That's a dandy time. Have I talked about the reload yet in this playthrough? I don't think I have. Um, because the um, there is there is an aspect of reloading in this game that. It's very open to exploitation. I'll show it off. You see how I've got... Use a crossbow bolt, empty the pistols clip, reload, switch back to the crossbow, and the crossbow has automatically reloaded while it was in my back pocket. Now, I thought for a while that this only applied to the crossbow because the crossbow does it the fastest, but apparently you can do this with any weapon. It just has to stay in your back pocket for X amount of time, and it'll automatically reload, which is awesome, because that means less time reloading means more time shooting bullets, and more time shooting bullets means less time that you have to frantically dodge attacks. Which is good. Ooh, I almost ate that. Okay, so that's very exploitable. The only thing is that different weapons have different timers for how long they have to sit in your pocket before they auto-reload. And I haven't really nailed down what those are, because I only just noticed this was a thing you could do recently. Like, I remember looking at some forums and stuff, and people were calling the Huntress, like, the most powerful character, and they were talking about, like, because her crossbow, because you can shoot the crossbow and then switch to the pistol. I'm like, yeah, but that's one crossbow bolt. It doesn't really help much, no. They were talking about that, being able to toggle back and forth. So there's an ammo lit for sale. The ammo lits increase the power of blanks, but I'm not really fond of the ammo lits because... Well, blanks are kind of rare, as you know. Fucking hate those lead maidens so much. Oh, I just loathe them. Map guy! Yes, I will gladly map this out for you. I like how he just gives you free stuff for doing what you should do anyway. Mimic? No mimic? The banana! <laughs> oh, the banana. I'll get to that in a moment. I don't want to say anything about the banana, but I'll get to it in a moment. Man, I would love to get the Alpha Bullet or something. Because I feel like that's what most of my runs come down to. If I can get some sort of upgrade that passively improves my guns, then things usually turn out well for me. And that's because while having powerful guns is all good and fine, 
having items that improve the power of your guns is better. Because, I mean, that, that improves all of your guns. I feel like I just said something really fucking obvious, like I expected it to be more significant than it was. I might be a little bit tired. I apologize if I seem even stupider than I usually am. <laughs> it's a joke because I'm secretly a genius. Yeah. My brother calls me the stupidest smart person ever. Or like, the smartest idiot ever, or the stupidest genius, or va variants on that theme, because I do numbers. I do numbers really good. I'm good with language. Well, specifically with English. I don't know any other languages, but I'm really good with English as a language when I'm focusing and not tired. But there is some things that I'm just... Mm, man, I get some stupid really hard. I can do numbers, though, so I'm okay. <laughs> For real, though, I want to know if anyone, if anyone was watching, see if my dog ate a bullet. Because I, I swear, I saw a bullet hit the dog and vanish. And that would be really, really awesome if it did, but I don't think it happens that often, because I don't... Like, I haven't seen it happen. Like, the bullets usually just go right through him, like they should. Ooh, third blank. That'll be useful. I am abusing the hell out of that reload. I wonder if the character's stats are all the same. And it's kind of a weird question to say, but I wonder if they have like the same stats. Like, do any of them have any modifiers for reload speed? or movement speed, or dodge roll speed, and I ask that because while I was playing the Convict, I really felt like she walked faster. I don't I don't actually think she did, but it felt like it for some reason. Red Goo on Stone improves dodging, and I believe what that means is you stay in the air for a little bit longer, and the vulnerable part at the end of the dodge where you're rolling is shorter, which is good. And no, I haven't forgotten to go get that television. I'm just, I want to use that, um, potion of lead skin to see if I can get the master round before I go. Hmm. That's the gun muncher. I will probably feed some guns to it, because I do not like this, um, thing. Banana. We, 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 what, do we, what do we want to do? We want to do the proton backpack and the banana? Nah, just the proton backpack. With the crossbow on the side, because why not? Ammo Conda! Fuck you! How long does that lead skin last? Proton Backpack is doing quite well. That killed him in a hurry. Perfect. Ammunition. Blanks activate poison. I've got some good shit. I've got full health. Let's go talk to the map dude. More rooms to... What do you mean more rooms to map? I thought I explored everywhere. Oh, there's something north of the... Uh, something north of here. 
Also, I do want to feed the Gamma Ray to the Gun Muncher, but I like all of the other guns I have. I don't know. Share completed map. And he gave me the ballot! Vote of confidence! Wonderful. Mmm, nah. I'm not gonna feed anything to the muncher, because sometimes you feed to the muncher and you get shit that's worse than what you put in. That's happened to me a couple times. It's not fun. It really is not fun. Let's see. So now we're gonna go over here. Okay. Nothing there. Drop the potion of lead skin. Much as I lament it. Carry the TV now. As you see, if you dodge roll, you drop the TV. And I usually dodge roll into the elevator for shits and giggles. And when I did, I dropped the TV and then regretted all of my life decisions. Okay, so, moving right along. I think I hear my curtain calling to me. I got my two floors, I got the television, and I'm set up to do the rest of the run. So thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like, drop a comment, give me some encouragement, and remind me to not be an idiot. But until the next episode, I must bid you all adieu until I see you again on the dark side.